Hello, I'm John Bender for PE.com and the Press Enterprise. Welcome to another episode of Political Empire. A little bit later, we will be talking with Riverside County reporter Jeff Horseman about Supervisor Jeff Stone's possible bid for Congress and how that's going over with the incumbent, Representative Ken Calvert. But first, our headline. Governor Jerry Brown this week announced that the state will be holding a special election to fill the vacant 32nd State Senate District seat that was emptied when Gloria Negretti McLeod got elected to Congress. The seat in San Bernardino County already has two interested uh, candidates, Norma Torres of Pomona and County Auditor Controller Larry Walker. Norma is an assemblywoman and Walker, they're both Democrats, so that should be an interesting race. Welcome, Jeff. How are you? I'm good. How are you? So tell me about Supervisor Jeff Stone. He's announced he's running for Congress, or he might run for Congress against Ken Calvert? Well, yeah, not exactly. What he's done is late last week he announced he was going to form an exploratory committee to look at a possible bid for the 42nd Congressional District, which is uh, currently held by Ken Calvert, who's been in Congress for over 20 years, and so he hasn't fully committed to running, but at the same time, he's uh, pretty much gone after Calvert for voting for the, he was, Calvert was one of 85 House Republicans to vote for the fiscal cliff bill, and in Stone's view, that this, this was a betrayal of his constituents because it subjected them to higher taxes and kind of sold out to the liberal leadership, um, and Calvert is firing right back, saying that Jeff Stone is basically an ambitious politician looking for the next run on the ladder, that uh, he defended his fiscal cliff vote saying that uh, it avoided a tax increase on the middle class. And so even though Jeff, uh, you know, he may run, he may not run, he said he's taking, he's going to take three months to decide, uh, it's already getting kind of heated. Right, we've gotten dueling press releases, haven't we? We have. We actually just got one today from Ken Calvert announcing that uh, Stone's four colleagues on the Board of Supervisors are in fact backing him. And I got in touch with all four and they all basically confirmed, yes, we are uh, backing Ken Calvert. Uh, um, they all, you know, to a man, they said it's not so much that we're against Jeff Stone, it's just that we feel that Calvert's the right man for the job. And but, what did Stone say in response? He uh, Stone basically yeah. uh, kind of said, you know, brushed it off, said, hey, you know, that's great that they're endorsing uh, my potential rival, but uh, this is obviously, a sign, in his view, a sign of panic on the part of Ken Calvert that he felt he needed to do this, that he needs to defend what uh, Stone considers to be a failed vote on behalf of his constituents and uh, you know Stone's also saying hey you know it, the only endorsement I'm interested in, in is the voters uh, come 2014 should I decide to run for this seat. Quite interesting we'll be watching that over the next year. Absolutely. Well thank you Jeff for PE.com and the Press Enterprise I'm politics editor John Bender.